In this video, we are going to show you how to add a Windows 10 computer as a client in a UCS domain. At first, we need to prepare our server. For this, we require additional software. It can be installed in the App Center. The Univention App Center is the platform for the installation and administration of business applications in UCS domains. After the installation process, all apps are ready to use and integrated in the existing IT infrastructure. Now we can select the Active Directory Domain Controller app and click on Install and install the Active Directory Domain Controller. As soon as it is installed, we can switch to our Windows 10 client. At first, we must switch the DNS server on our Windows computer to the DNS server of our UCS domain, if not already done. To do this, I select the Network and Internet settings down here, select Change Adapter Options, right-click our adapter and select Properties. Depending on which Internet protocol your client is communicating with, choose version 4 or version 6. We select Properties and choose Use the following DNS server addresses. Now. I enter the IP address of my UCS Domain Master and select OK. Furthermore, I right-click on our Ethernet controller, deactivate it briefly and enable it again to make sure it's connected to the DNS server. We now close our settings and check with our web browser if we are able to access our UCS Domain. And we can see that we are able to access our UCS server through this address. What we are going to do now is to look for the PC's information, which we find inside the control panel. Under Computer Name Domain in Workgroup Settings, we select Change Settings and click on Change. Here we change the option Member of from Workgroup to Domain and enter as Domain Organization Intranet from our address. Now we select OK. Now we need to log in once with our Domain Administrator account and choose OK. Shortly after, the message Welcome to the Organization Intranet Domain shows up on the display. We select OK to close it. The computer needs to be restarted now. This is what we are going to do. Once the computer has been restarted, we can log in with a user of our UCS domain. If you have any further questions, please have a look at the official documentation. This was a short instruction on how to add a Windows 10 machine to your UCS domain. You can find more information and the UCS download at univention.com. Stay up to date and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials about UCS. Thanks a lot.